He comes down almost every single day. I love you. Oh my goodness gracious. He just comes down to hang <laughs> out and jump on me or he likes to do flips on my arm. One of my best friends from high school called me and said that she had found a baby squirrel that had fallen out of a cut down tree. Immediately I go get it. Every four hours we fed him. Morning, Fred. At that age, squirrels just sleep all day long. Quickly though, they start to get active. He was like doing back flips and front flips. Oh oh. Ah. The goal was always to release him, but we were always kind of worried about if he was going to be okay. Ready? Yeah. But like the second he started getting active and climbing around, it was like the instincts kicked in. Frederick, what are you doing? What do you think you're doing down there? And we were like, oh, he's going to be just fine. Around like three months, I think we knew we were going to let him go soon. One day we just walked outside and let him climb up the pecan tree in the backyard. And he was like, all right, sweet, I'm good. And just ran off. Look at you go, buddy. Wow. Sure enough, he showed back up. Yay. I love you, Boogie. I love you. In the very beginning, he would come multiple times a day. There were a couple times where he would come up to the sliding oh. glass door. What are you doing? Hey, buddy. Hi, monkey. I love you. Good morning. I'll come out there, okay? I'll come out there. Nobody better be out here bullying my little baby. It was really hot this summer, and he would come up to the sliding glass door and be like, hey, can I come back in there? <laughs> I was still was like giving him nuts and setting food out for him. Good stuff, buddy. Love you. But as soon as the first day of fall hit, that it was like cool enough, and he was like hoarding nuts like crazy, it was like, where are you taking that? I don't need your help anymore. I've got it figured out. And now he just comes down to hang out with me, which is super fun. There you are, Boogie, yeah! <laughs> you can tell he really loves Allie and wants to play with her and not just go to her for food. He's definitely a wild animal, but he chooses to come back down and jump on me or like wants me to flip him or scratch him or whatever, which I think is so cute.